the morning. Man, it's 3.30 in the morning. I had a vision. And I got the shag because it woke me up. And uh, I was told to say that y'all know I don't bite my motherfucking tongue, so it don't even fucking matter. But uh, this for the pastor. Y'all remember that? Uh, y'all remember that day that y'all had that? Uh, program right so I collected I removed myself from one church you know to go to another church where I knew the person <laughs> I shouldn't even went there huh but um these two churches they collide together like on programs and stuff like that So they had a program and they were, it, the whole family was there. The whole family of the people I was working for, every last one of her children was there. A lot of them didn't really, they didn't really want to come, but you know, it was for their mother, which was cool. But uh, what I didn't know was that they connect with the other church that I walked away from, right? It ain't no need to me be there. So they they was having a program, right? I seen how Nikki and uh, the first lady over there looked at me when I was talking to this other first lady and somebody else. I seen the look on their face, which I didn't give a fuck. Fuck both of them. First Lady and Nikki, I don't give a fuck. Ain't no motherfucking First Ladies, no motherfucking way. Let Gino tell it. Ain't no First Ladies. The First Lady dead and gone. That was Eve. So anyway, y'all check it out. Before service has started, it had not started yet, you know. It was just... Oh, the praying and the singing and shit, whatever. They ain't done all that. I was sitting there, right? And they were singing and all of that. And God said, get up. Get up and go now. Y'all, I didn't even hesitate. I got my motherfucking purse and walked right for the motherfucking door. Walk right for the motherfucking dough. Y'all, look how this gonna go, though. The way where my car was parked, I was blocked in. Right? It's like my car was blocked in. I couldn't get out because we was on the little hill. Let me show y'all, man, how go all work. Maybe I maneuvered through them motherfucking cars and got up out of there. But check it out. I got up. And went out to go get in my car. Right? I didn't expect for nobody to come behind me. But the pastor came right behind me. He was looking for me. Y'all, I was standing right there looking at the man, and the man didn't see me. I was like, I'm right here. What is he looking for? He was looking right at me and didn't see me. God told me to get out of that motherfucker. And he, I watched the pastor walk out the church, around, around, looked around the building, looked out, looked right out there, and he was like, well, she, you know, looking like, dang, she got out, she got out. And y'all, I hadn't even left yet. I was still right there, unlocking my car door to get in. God will make you visible to motherfuckers. When God say move, He mean move, just like that. And that's what I do. And everybody wondering why I get gone, I go. Tanika, this for you. You lied on me. 
or somebody lied on me talking about I throw it around in a circle. What circle? I ain't fuck now person in this county. Not you, your mama, nobody. Your brother, your cousin, nobody. I ain't fuck nobody in this county, so how did I throw something in a circle? I ain't had no dick in over three years, and I bust a nut every chance I feel like I want to. Real talk. Ain't nothing but a nut. Ain't nothing but you releasing pressure. And some of y'all out here go crazy because y'all pussy and dick sick. Y'all got addictions. And not drug addictions. Y'all addictions is sex, money, and power. Something that don't none of y'all have. Power is none of y'all. Now, I got another thing I want to say. Donald Trump dick eating ass. Going to sit up on the thing and say that's why he got a lot of black voters because they be the black people be discriminated against so much. They feel like he being discriminated. Donald Trump, don't nobody play with that shit but you. Bitch, you want us to be slaves again. Ain't going to happen. Because if I don't want you white son of a bitches walk up and push me upside my motherfucking head, I'm going to beat the goddamn dog shit out you, bitch. See, it's a good thing. A lot of us wouldn't have been here today if slavery was still a part of our lives. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You understand what I'm saying? We'd have been a, it'd have been a lot of dead motherfucking monkeys. That's what y'all want to call us, niggas and all of that. It'd have been a lot of them. I'd have been one of them. They'd have been pushing up my days. I'd have been in a pine box by now, cause I'd have knocked the fuck out of one of you motherfuckers. I wouldn't give a fuck. That's why God said no, no, no. I can't let her come up in them days, cause she ain't gonna last a minute. It ain't gonna last a minute. Uh, and all you white motherfuckers love to stick your dick in us, don't you? Y'all love to stick your dick in us and rape us niggas because our pussy better than your white wives. Hmm? That's why so many mixed motherfucking kids run around here on the plantation. You motherfuckers got life and bullshit. All fucked up. I don't know which one of you Prestons. <clears throat> I said it. I had the gogs and the ball to do me like that. I'm, this is a message for one of you Prestons. You know which one. You, now, they say it was two of them involved. I can't believe y'all, man. I can't believe y'all. I took care of y'all mama more than y'all ever did. I don't give a fuck how many motherfucking workers she had. Didn't none of them want to work for her. That's why y'all couldn't keep none of them. And you know what else they said? Y'all run around here. Y'all act like everybody. Y'all so good and holy. You know what I was saying about y'all? Didn't nobody want to work for y'all because y'all don't want to pay. Y'all want to y'all want to give orders and want this to happen, but y'all don't want to pay. But I never said nothing, and it wasn't never about the money with me. But y'all call y'all self trying to use me. Y'all ain't use me. I want that to be known. Y'all ain't use me, baby. I done something y'all couldn't do. Not couldn't do. Y'all didn't want to do. And then, y'all fuck around with my money some kind of way with girling and let the pastor get y'all uh, homegirls and all of this that he know work fucking with my job and my money. And then I'm working for less, but y'all using me like that? Y'all weren't using me, so don't think y'all was using me. I was helping y'all more than I, it, I wasn't even doing it for y'all. <laughs> I was doing it for y'all, y'all father and God. That's why nothing was able to touch me or take me out 
when I was up there, even at night working, even with the powder blast. So just know, y'all ain't hurt me. Y'all ain't hurt me. Because when y'all start fucking with me, God start taking her mobility away. It ain't. It wasn't that she was doing that on because she's very capable. It was God taking her mobility away because y'all was taking my money away, and y'all was fucking over me. Tell me how she lost her insurance when she shouldn't have. It's because y'all was fucking with me. It wasn't nothing just happening. It ain't not got. That ain't got nothing to do with the motherfucking government. That's something that's forever. That's something that's forever. She shouldn't have never had to lose that and go in a nursing home. That's forever. So y'all make it make sense. Y'all tell me what happened. I kept saying, well, you know how the, you know how, how the government work. They take their time. It might be tomorrow. It might be a month from now, two months from now. I don't know. But I got all the paperwork that done in. Y'all already knew that you lost it. And y'all already knew fucking why. And y'all sit up and say, it's best to go over there. And then not only that, y'all call me and ask me to go sit with her every day for 300 motherfucking dollars. $300? Did I look like a dummy to y'all? I wasn't dumber than now one of y'all. It looked like all of y'all got all that education and dumb as fuck. But not only that, y'all play with federal charges with my life, with my money. I ain't worried about it. Because I'm good. And my day gonna keep on going. But I know the next person that I work for I'm going to make sure I got a full, I ain't working for now, another motherfucker in health care until this health care fraud of minds get settled. And they already found that health fraud, health care fraud, fucking with my shit. Somebody that's trying to get they out to make it. Somebody bust they ass if y'all call me at 2 or 3 o'clock in the morning. Mama hurt herself. I'm on my way. Get up out of my motherfucking bed. When it's, when she got a whole daughter that live right down the street from her. Grandkids live right down, right there by. That they can shoot over there. But now, they don't call them. They don't go. But then I take care of somebody that can't take care of themselves, and then y'all take my money and fuck it around and give it to a, another bitch. Y'all got me fucked up. Y'all got me way fucked up, Preston. And I know, I, 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 and my thing is this: I know every all them all of the, them did not know what's going on. All of y'all was not with, behind this shit. It's two of y'all. I can I know exactly who it is. I know exactly who it is, and it's easy for y'all to. Mm, 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 mm. Ain't it good to know you put your whole family in jeopardy, man? Both of y'all. How y'all feel about that? I bet a lot of y'all wonder why I ain't coming back around, why I ain't been around. Y'all finding out. I can't believe this. <laughs> oh, we man. You can't trust nobody. And and you know what? It, this this will always happen to me, y'all. The people I trust the most and love the most be the motherfuckers that's stabbing me in the side of my neck. Same thing happened to me in Austin. Happened to me right here in Lagrange. But it won't happen no motherfucking more. Because what what a lot of people fail to realize, being around me, gonna bring healing, love, 
and everything else that you need because long as you're good to me, God going to make everything come your way good for you because you're good to his chosen one. But y'all didn't see me as that. Y'all see me as competition because I don't speak what y'all speak. I don't, I praise God, but I don't know who y'all praise because that ain't of God. Y'all don't praise God, and I ain't no Christian, and nobody can't bang nothing into my head. You can bang that Bible in my head because that's all, that's all I go for. I don't go to church for nothing there but to be taught the Bible. And ain't now one of y'all teaching it right, so I need to be up there with Gino Jennings. But if I want to go in his church, I know I ain't finna go in there with no earrings on, no nothing on. I'm just going to get the word. And I ain't got to be a Christian. When you be a Christian, if you want to be a Christian, you, the right person going to lead you that way. And being a Christian means you got to do that Bible. If, you, if you're not willing to live accordingly to that Bible, you can't consider yourself a Christian. And I know damn well I ain't. And I ain't going to try to pretend to be. Because being a Christian, who we, man, it ain't using people. Being a Christian, it ain't going against people working with other people to try to take people out. Because Really why y'all was doing it, because y'all didn't want me to expose y'all's secret. Y'all didn't want me to find out who y'all was. So y'all thought y'all was t attacking me undercover. No, baby, y'all wasn't. And I want to make something known. I don't know what y'all plan was around the holidays, but God said don't go. And I didn't. God told me not to take that $300 and sit at that nursing home because that wasn't shit. I'm going lower. I went from $12.79 to $10 waiting on them to get my stuff back to get her insurance back that she never was going to get and they knew this, evidently. And then Whammo. It hit me in the gut. Boom. All of a sudden, bam, everything stopped at one time. Boom, boom, boom. She had to go to the nursing home. Boom, I was cut off. I ain't never been cut off because ain't shit stopped for me. And I ain't going to no nursing home to see nobody. And I love her to death. Y'all, it don't matter to me. But I ain't going over there. And I ain't finna go sit over there for no 300 motherfucking dollars. That ain't no motherfucking money. I got a motherfucking insurance. I got motherfucking light bill. I got a motherfucking gas bill. I got motherfucking clothes need to be washed. How the fuck I'ma live off of 300 motherfucking dollars? So y'all can keep draining up my energy. I ain't getting no more of this motherfucker. This energy I got is powerful. I don't know who this old bullshit ass lawyer they talking about. But I ain't worried about it. She ain't that bad. She ain't better than the two I got. See, I got two of them. Not only do I got two lawyers... I got the FBI, the CIA, the DEA, the government. So y'all fucking with my check and, and at the job and all of that, and I was still on payroll, but I wasn't making money because I was waiting on the insurance to come back, but I was still on the payroll, but I wasn't getting paid. And Brittany, whoever Brittany was, was getting paid my motherfucking 1279 for almost three months. Make it make sense. Make it make sense.
Brittany, whoever you are, bitch. I hope your motherfucking ass like the feds. Because you got a federal charge, bitch. Brittany. Ho. And you know what? The man with, with all the master plan came up with a good idea. A regular dope friend ass girlfriend of yours. A healthcare worker at that. That's what I heard. A crack smoking bitch. That's what I heard. Mm -hmm. You crack smoking bitches is crazy. Y'all, y'all must don't y'all y'all crack y'all do <coughs> y'all might need to go to Austin and get and, and hook up with some of my homeboys cause uh see my homeboy you know they'll give you a, 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 a three or four nine hits they they'll, they'll give you a little something you know what I'm saying. You ain't got the uh, plot and plan uh, uh, to get $1,300 to, <coughs> to try to fulfill a mission that can be fulfilled. You know what I'm saying? $1,300? I wouldn't even smoke no crap. I would have got dead on the mission, huh? Yeah. But see, God got plans. I ain't fit to be touched. I don't know what the plan was. Who was going to stab me or rape me or do something? But I got up. I, that's when I was at Tanika house. God said, get up right now and leave. Because somebody is in that bathroom. And we don't want them to drop dead. Go. Go. Get out. That's when I told Tanika, I said, so, yo, I'll be back. I got to go. I'm out of here. I'm going to the library. And I ain't been back since. Because God told me, make that move. People not realizing and understanding that I'm not going to shut up. I'm not going to back down. When God give me messages, I'm going to show y'all who work for God and who don't. Because y'all ain't getting no messages, evidently. And y'all ain't right because everything I'm putting out, if the laws ain't came to God, got me yet, why not? Because the laws already know the laws finna get got. Because some of y'all brought y'all homeboys and y'all friends in it, like the mayor. What's up, Jan? You have no right to call no orders on me. Have me checked out, looked out, because your cousin, Mr. Eddie, say, all, I'm, I, all I got to do is tell Jan. Jan going to get on me. That's what he told me. I don't got to worry about nothing. I just tell Jan, Jan going to take care of me. Just like what's talking about the landlord. I'm going to tell Jan what this landlord is doing, and he, Jan going to take care of it. Jan ain't got that motherfucking right. She's the mayor, not the problem solver. You got to go through motherfucking shit just like everybody else because you know somebody that's a mess. She going to pull the strings for you. If she going to pull strings for you, she better pull them for everybody in the motherfucking county. And that's real talk. But when y'all went and put that motherfucking case on me about harming a child, y'all all fucked up. And all of y'all going to hang by the head of y'all motherfucking feet. Because I'm going to see to it that it happened. A whole innocent person come here to better they say, I'm in my calling. I'm doing what I'm called to do by God. Because he told me to do it. And y'all trying to say I'm not who I am. Fuck y'all. Who cares what y'all think? Y'all falling and I ain't. So I must be who the fuck I say I am. Because it's just not making sense. And for this CPS worker, bitch, you better not come talking about, talking about nothing to me. Bitch, I'm going to slap the fuck out you, hoe. 
because you accused me of fucking over somebody's child and you couldn't help, you you couldn't save my grandchild? Fuck you. And them too. I don't give a fuck. And my grandson out there probably still being fucked over or fucked with by another motherfucking man or something. When I told told y'all my baby told me that, y'all didn't do nothing. But y'all want to accuse me of, of hurting a, a, a disabled child. Y'all got me fucked up. And we know who put the burn on the baby. I do. Y'all know now. You are feeling stupid in the motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all ain't gonna be able to handle me in the courtroom, man. I swear to God, I'm gonna eat y'all motherfucking ass up. But I ain't gotta say too much. And the reason why I ain't gotta say too much, because the FBI gonna talk for me. The CIA gonna talk for me. The DEA going to talk for me. The FBI going to talk for me. Because they've been investigating me. Oh, we. See, but but see, what y'all fail to realize, LaGrange, Texas, you motherfuckers that's been having power, that's been doing this all alone, everybody that y'all look down on, going to talk bad about y'all motherfucking ass, and y'all ain't going to be able to take it. They're going to talk so down on y'all motherfucking ass, y'all going to want to leave this motherfucking town. After I get my justice, I don't want nothing to do with this motherfucking town. Because it's a bunch of ignorant niggas in this motherfucker. That's what I call y'all a bunch of ignorant niggers. They work for the white man who control y'all. How y'all stupid asses to go out and do some dumb shit and work with y'all to get paid. How a motherfucker that already got money want more money? Take money from a motherfucker that ain't got no money. Trying to get money. And y'all trying to stop my money. Y'all try to have control over me, bitches. Y'all can't control your own motherfucking self. Who the fuck gonna control? How y'all gonna have control over a grown motherfucking angel, bitch? That's what I said. I'm a whole earth angel walking around this motherfucker, and all of y'all know it now. But y'all feeling the heat, because y'all came for the wrong motherfucker. It's exciting to know that y'all got a whole earth angel walking on earth, and y'all don't even know it. Y'all know it. Y'all know it now. Everybody in these goddamn apartments know that shit. I bet they do now. All the crows, the eagles, the birds, the deers, the butterflies. Every time a motherfucker come around me, them goddamn eagles on guard. Touch her. Act like you want to do something. And they come low to the flow. And not only do they come low, they walk around my motherfucking yard, around my door, around my car. They walk like, come on up here, bitch. Everybody else be like, we scared. I be out there with 99 motherfucking crows in the back of my goddamn yard. And my dog be walking around. They get what they do. Walk around my motherfucking dog. So for you and for you son of a bitches that call yourself trying to take my dog out, he ain't going nowhere. See, he ain't going nowhere. He not just any motherfucking dog, can't you tell? Can't you tell? A chihuahua don't listen. Dumbass people. A chihuahua do not listen like that because it's a dog. Don't y'all see that? Y'all can y'all can't even let y'all dog off the leash in these motherfucking apartments and, and let him up and tell him to sit down, you'll never catch him. You'll never catch him. 
until he's ready to come home. Pierre know better. Pierre not that type of dog. Pierre going to sit and watch and observe. Pierre got an old soul. And remember this. Pierre is one of my spirit guides. That's why he's been here so long. Y'all, I heard motherfuckers talking about chipping the dog and chipping this. Chipping shit. If y'all chipped him, if y'all chipped the motherfucker, it was when y'all when I took him to the vet and had to leave him. It don't matter. He ain't chipped nothing. It don't matter if he chipped or not. <laughs> Cause wherever I go, he gonna go. And if y'all chipped him, cause y'all know he gonna go. It ain't no problem. Cause I'm not worried about now some bitch doing nothing to me. Not a one. Not a one, because y'all can't succeed. The last despair y'all did, that was the wrong thing to do. And Destiny, you over there losing your cuckoo-ass mind. Destiny and Ivory. <laughs> oh, Lord, this bitch, I know this bitch losing her cuckoo-ass mind. Bitch, how you gonna go get married in my name? How you gonna marry in my name? How you gonna forge my name? Let me ask y'all something. Y'all been doing this so long, forging shit. Do you know that's a federal charge? And I'm filing on all of y'all. I ain't letting up on none of y'all. I want the rich to go to jail. Mm, I want you rich bitches to be humiliated. Huh? That's what I want for y'all. I don't want God to kill none of y'all. I want you rich bitches to go to jail. So when y'all go to jail, the people in y'all county that be in jail when y'all in there beat y'all motherfucking ass. And you know what, y'all? Some of the police officers don't let it happen. Long enough to get y'all slapped around, then they're going to run in there and, 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 and stop the fight. Y'all got to know who y'all fucking with. And if you ain't, and if you ain't <laughs> a fan of the system <laughs> or been there long enough, <laughs> you won't understand what I'm talking about. Because let me show y'all something. Just because we go to prison, prison got everything that prison got everything. School, college, trades, anything you can take to be a better person when you get out and make big money. They even got welding school in that motherfucker. Auto mechanics in that motherfucker. You can get a motherfucking scholarship. Not a scholarship. Yeah, in that motherfucker. Yes, you can. You can go to college. You can graduate, bitches. You heard me? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's it, yeah. So, just know, when y'all go, and by us being in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out, you know, it's it, if it's a thousand, over a thousand inmates, it's over a thousand officers, right? So, every shift, there's a different officer come on, right? And that just might be the officer that cut for you on their shift. So when officer come on, uh, when your officer come on your shift, oh, uh, it's going there. We already know when everybody favorite officer come, we bag up. You know what I'm saying? We not haters like that. But my thing is this: you gotta know your name spreads around that system, and people like you. So don't think y'all gonna walk up in a motherfucking jailhouse and they say, y'all for y'all, this this the bitch right here, Katana Holly. We fucked over that bitch. They, and then soon as y'all say Katana Holly, and people antennas gonna go up in that motherfucking system. Some of y'all ain't gonna make it in there though. I'm telling you, they already know what you're coming for. They already know what you did, and they already know who you did it to. And my name stand for something. Katana 
It ain't no two. It ain't no katanas around here. But one, a girl named her daughter Katana after me. Uh, uh, goddamn, what's that girl name? Uh, Daw, 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 baby, the one living out. Not this one down here. The one living out. Daw named her little girl Katana. Cause she used to, when I was a little girl going to school and she told me, she said, when I have my baby, my, when I have me a baby, I'm going to name my baby your name. I said, okay. And, the, and that motherfucker had her first little girl, named her little girl Katana. She sure did. They lived up there by us. They were goo baby them people. Goo baby head, all of them people. They, we all grew up over there on Saw Wilson. Yeah, them. And, uh, uh. Yeah. So just know, I'm really stuck to know. All I did for the Prestons, y'all thought y'all was dogging me out. And the bad part about it, Austin had something to do with it. That little poho had something to do with it. I came up there to go with that old dope crack smoking ass bitch, drive that black car. We ain't gonna do no plan. We ain't gonna do no plan, but that's all right. I got something for your motherfucking ass. <laughs> you thought y'all was smart enough. I bet y'all won't fuck with nobody else. Healthcare. Y'all got some health fraud. Healthcare fraud is what you gonna get. I hope you good for getting that healthcare fraud, and I hope you ain't no motherfucking uh, felon, because if you is, bitch. <laughs> You get ready, because whoever did it, they say they do have a felony. Jenny, I don't know what part you played, baby, but get what? We already know what time it is with you. That right. I hate, first of all, it's 3.30 in the motherfucking morning. <laughs> One thing I hate about being spiritual. When you sleeping, God show you shit. And I'm like, why is this happening to me? Why, why, why is this stuff coming up about this church thing? Because God say that's what I wanted you to get out of there. That day. Y'all knew what was going down, but I didn't. But why why affiliate, why join another church that affiliates with the motherfucking people I'm getting away from? Ain't no need to be affiliated with none of them, God said, because they work together. Ain't now, get out of there. Which one of y'all used to be a pimp? Which pimp? Which one? Uh, 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 not the pimp. Pimp, 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 pimp. A pastor that used to be a pimp. Ancestors say, you ain't collecting hoes. <laughs> God damn. Ancestors say, this is not where you pick up hoes at in the congregation. When you got a whole wife. That what I heard? Mm, mm, mm. And y'all preach the word. Oh, y'all ought to be shaming y'all self. That's why everything going down. I don't know which one of it is. It's a celebrity coming after me. And it ain't doing them no motherfucking good. Keep coming. I know I need to go on and get me a new car. But I'm going to dry that motherfucker till the wheels pay, fall out. I paid for that motherfucker myself. $2,854. Y'all took from me from a motherfucking savage-ass motherfucking car that I worked my hard-earned time for a motherfucker that's falling apart. Like it was going like, to give me hurt in it. Go. That motherfucking car is magic. Y'all remember that movie? Chitty, chitty, bang, bang, chitty, chitty, bang, bang, we love you. Hey, hey, chitty, chitty, pop, pop, chitty, chitty, pop, pop. You know why? Because that motherfucker supposed to be them blowed up by now. (laughs) 
blowed up. The wiring ain't right in the motherfucker. They say that. And I don't give a fuck. Because every time I get in that motherfucker, you know what I say? I say, God, I'm about to go out here. I got to go do this. Please don't let nothing happen to this motherfucker. What's coming to loose? Can you wire that shit back up and let me hit the road? God say, hit the road, baby. Drove that bitch all the way to Austin. <laughs> 75 bound on that back road. Ooh, wait. With four motherfucking planes following me. And the planes that was following me wasn't no airplanes. They were army planes. God damn. And I seen them the whole time. Y'all, I know what time it is. I'm not doing no plan. Y'all better stay up and pray up and watch out because y'all came for the wrong person. And a whole lot of y'all know that now. (coughs) 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 Now, I ain't Miss Cleo, baby. I'm the Empress of Love. The same motherfucker you gonna need to ask the question. Because you gonna need some answers. And for the people that live in LaGrange, Texas, I got a special price for y'all on readings. 22. 22. For the people only in the community. Them the angels number 22. 22. Don't be ashamed to come and ask me for a read. I flat out read it to you right then. A question, you need a question, $20 for two questions. Yeah, that's only for the community of LaGrange, 22, 22. I'll be more than happy to lower my standards from 44, 44 to 22, 22 only in the community. Because I think a lot of people right now want to know what the fuck is going on. I'm not a witch. I'm a chosen one that show love to anybody. I don't care what you look like. You can look like Bugs Bunny nephew. You, if you, if I love you, you my motherfucking friend. And if somebody say you an ugly bitch, I'm a, we gonna kick their ass together. And you might be ugly. <coughs> <coughs> but to me, you not. I don't judge y'all. I love everybody. And I'm going to put this out here. And I'm going to call your name out, too, because you know I ain't no punk bitch. <laughs> Tawana, I want to say this to you. You let somebody else get you into doing what you did and saying what you said. Because I want you to know this. I never would have done nothing for you. I didn't do that for your mother. I didn't even do it for you. I did it because somebody asked me. You know who asked me. We ain't going to go there. We ain't going to blast it. But you know who asked me. That's why I did it. And you know what? That ain't you. That ain't none of you, baby. Real talk. Because I talk to you all the time. I was around you, baby. You were so fucking stressed out, little girl. You didn't know which way to go. Because at the end of the day, baby, you ain't had nobody. You ain't had nobody. You had to do what you had to do. But in, by doing it, you was taking care of what was yours, yours and everybody else. 
and then they 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 caught you at your worst. And they had you to do something and say something that was so untrue. And you rolled with it because you needed it at the time, I guess. But they also know you vulnerable. They know how 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 weak you are. They know you just want to be loved and 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 that's how people that's how people get over on us. I'ma say us. Cause the same thing that was done to you was always done to me. I see it. Just by being around you. And you try to please everybody, baby, and make everybody happy just to like you. But don't nobody care about you unless you're coming to their rescue. Come take me here. Come do this. Come do that. Then everybody loves you. And when they need you. But ain't nobody going to fall with you after they put you up to do something so fucking ridiculous. Because that's what it was. And not only was I good to her, I was good to you. I always wanted to make sure you was all right. And I used to tell you all the time, stop worrying about that. Stop worrying about that, baby. Keep going. Don't worry about it. Every day, it was something. Every day. It was something. Because I kept your baby for you and I was helping you out. But every day, it was something. And every day, you picked your child up. She was clean Monday, Wednesdays, and Friday. Ate good. Smelled good. Looked good. I picked that baby up, put that baby in that motherfucking cute-ass wheelchair. I think the wheelchair was so cute. And put her outside, she be mad in the motherfucker. She want to go in. But then she starts seeing the birds and shit. I didn't mind doing that. That was from my heart. And what I charged you was a little bit of nothing because you were surprised. Because it wasn't for the money, baby. It ain't never about money with me. It was about your baby with me. And I did that so while you be at work, you got a peace of mind. I ain't got to worry about it, my baby being messed with. I ain't got to worry about my baby having no burn. I ain't got to worry about my baby, my baby, my baby. Because your baby was fine. And every time you came to pick her up, she just be smiling. Think she be hitting you in your face telling you, put me down, leave me here. And I got so attached to her, I wait on her. Because I loved her. And I loved her a whole lot more because she couldn't do shit for her motherfucking self. And I was her angel for the moment. And I motherfucking gave her so much motherfucking love. I bet she in heaven right now saying, I love you, Tan Tan. Yeah, you and PP. And I want you to know this, little girl. I forgive you. But the rest of your family, they can eat dick. I don't give a fuck about them. None of them. And for the motherfuckers that talked you into doing this bullshit, they all gonna fall by the wayside, baby. And I want you to know this. God know what you go through. What I don't what 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 I don't see or nobody else see, God standing right over y'all. And to and to one up. You know how spiritual I am. And I hope you ain't the one that was going up against me because you'll never win against me, baby, because I'm powerful. 
I'm the real deal Holyfield. I ain't to be played with. I don't walk around playing with it. This ain't a game to me. And even though I know who I am, I don't brag and boast because I don't want nobody to be fucked out. Because he fucking with me. God going to fuck out people. And my ancestors, I, my ancestors are not any ancestors, y'all. This is what I want y'all to know. I, I done went, I done did everything that I supposed to do just by listening to my ancestors and moving. When they say move, I done woke up to ancient ancestors. Because they mad. They say, now we, it's enough. Woo, these people going to the graveyards and playing with this shit. This shit is powerful. This shit is not a joke. And the whole world about to know it. But I just hate you got wrapped up in this stuff that I got going on in my life, baby. Because this way deeper than you, honey. This go deeper than you and your yours. Understand me? It's deep, deep, deep. Deep. And nobody never knew nothing because I never said nothing. I just kept... I just kept going. I just kept going. But y'all know what? One person that I told, and that was Mr. Eddie. I told Mr. Eddie what was going on. I told Mr. Eddie what was coming to me in the mail. I told Mr. Eddie all my motherfucking business. And Mr. Eddie, you took your motherfucking ass over there and told the mayor, V.C., all of them about what was coming to me. The mail bitch holding up my mail and shit. Y'all playing with me like that? That's federal charges, baby. Them federal charges. The accidents y'all want me to have. Your daughter done had 99 of them banged up a car. Because what you wanted for me happened to yours. I ain't lost nothing. Look like you lose. And it's a goddamn shame, Pastor. That I don't I, I can't even make friends in this county because everybody praise you. You got control over everybody. Well, bitch, I don't need to make no motherfucking friends. My friends right in here with me. I see them every day, talk to them every day. And I'm going to watch them beat your motherfucking ass for playing with me, punk. You're a punk. A background high punk. You hide in the motherfucking background. Don't show your hand, bitch. You ain't got to show it to me because I see it in my motherfucking dream. I get visions, bitch. Everybody you work with, from the motherfucking landlord on down. I know what time it is. All the illegal motherfucking shit going on over there. But ain't nobody saying nothing because the pastor run it. The landlord getting a little change here and there. I don't give a fuck. Landlord don't need your motherfucking change. And why it's a new sheriff in town. And I want to tell y'all motherfuckers something in this county. Y'all don't even know that somebody that y'all work with is the motherfucker going to take y'all down. Mm-hmm. Yeah, y'all working with the head CIA. That's what I hear. The head motherfucker. That's going to bag me up on everything that I say is true. 
And that was the reason to come back because they want the officials. See, from what I hear, people are scared to go up against y'all because of what y'all will do to them. Y'all ain't going to do shit to me. Y'all already tried. I got 990 million motherfucking lives. You heard me? Y'all can't stop me. And, and trying to make me homeless. Y'all can't stop me. Y'all ain't gonna hurt me. Y'all motherfuckers must don't know what it is to be homeless. Homeless people get it. You know what? And a lot of people don't want to live in apartments and live and pay rent because you know why? They don't want to deal with shit like this. People complain, oh, they live in a neighborhood. I don't like her. I, she, I just don't like her. Because you don't like a motherfucker. You want to get them out your neighborhood. Fuck you, bitch. I don't like you either, ho. I don't like none of you motherfucking bitches. Over here. How about that? I said over here. One man I love over here. I didn't say, and it ain't the men, it's the bitches. And Mr. Elias, your ass ain't exempt some of a bitch. You the reason it started on Curtly with them cameras with you and Robert. You the rich motherfucker. Yeah, you will. When I get through with your motherfucking ass, currently going to be shut down. Yeah, what you need to be doing, putting some motherfucking new trailers on that motherfucking. Stop taking people money that do drugs because the drug addicts pay with drugs. Because it ain't nothing. To, a dog couldn't live in that motherfucker. I went down Curly the other day. They got a trailer that's been abandoned for years. Now somebody, done, that man done rented that motherfucker out. That's sad. Go to show you how much a motherfucker really give a fuck about you. This motherfucker got money. He don't give a fuck about you motherfucking drug addicts. Niggas, meth head. He know y'all need a place to stay. And he rents a motherfucker like sex offenders and all of that. that, that, that. And know y'all do drugs and that, 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 that. But he don't give a fuck. Because y'all can live in that raggedy shit. And half of y'all making meth and running from the laws back there in the woods. Whole lot of meth was being made back there. That's when that shit bombed up the back there, blowed up on that boy and burnt him back there. When we was back there, we heard that big boom. There go the ambulance. The meth lab back there. And you knew about it. You knew what they were doing. That's why you rented it to them. Crooked motherfucker. It be the white motherfuckers that sit up high. The crooked motherfuckers, the drug dealers, the dope dealers, they're producing the shit. Letting the shit come through the government. Letting the shit come through the police officer. It's enough of that shit. It's enough of you government officials running around here thinking y'all got power. Power is what y'all supposed to have. But if y'all going to use that power, use it to defend, not steal. That's why all you motherfuckers looking like dick eaters right now. Biting your son over there making deal. All these motherfuckers making deal. Oh, oh. In Israel and all this here shit, and y'all over here talking about helping us. Y'all ain't did shit for us. Y'all over there partying off of the, I, I, what, what, what's supposed to help us and protect us and take care of us. Y'all over there building y'all own shit. So when it's time for y'all to come out of office, y'all set. But God said, uh-uh, ain't no more stash, and we gonna pull all that stash up out of there. If we got to bring a two Sami to bring the shit up, that's what we gonna do. I'm gonna release it. Everything that's hidden is coming out. Money that's hid under the ground, dead people that's hid under the ground ain't supposed to be under there. Guess what? They all fit to come out during the storm. That why? That right? It's a storm of brum, but now it's coming as fire. Y'all got preachers out here. They ain't telling y'all this is going to happen because they don't know. Because they not preachers. They ain't supposed to be there. They had to go to school to be there. See? 
anybody can be a pastor. I can be a pastor. I can be a pastor. I can go to school, take the classes, get the certificate, open the goddamn church. Find me a building and open it. Tell me, anybody. But like Pastor Gino Jennings said, it's a calling. God will come to you personally and tell you, son, it's time for you to get over here and do the work. He'll come to you. Just like he came to me to show me. You have nothing to worry about. I'm real. I'm going to take care of you. Please have no fear. And I have none. Have no fear. And I want you to have faith in me. Even though you don't see me. But I felt his kiss. And I heard his voice. And the most shocking thing is. His voice. Is tender. You know what I'm saying? You be like, I, 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 I would have, I was like, if he go out, I was like, I would be expecting him to say, you have nothing to worry about. I'm going to bring it down. You know, you have faith. No, 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 no. Because God is a kind man, a loving man, a loyal man. A man that don't lie and a man that say, if I say I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. But in my time, not yours. Because it's a process. You're going to stay safe. You're going to see them fall at your feet. But nothing ain't going to come towards you. It ain't going to touch you. Whatever they send towards you, it ain't going to touch you. Psalms 91. It ain't going to touch you. And for y'all that don't know what's going on right now, Psalms 91 is going on right now as we speak. And I know it is because I'm living it. You know, I'm living it. And he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. All right? Y'all hear what it say? I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge <laughs> and my fortress. My God in him will I trust. I trust nobody but God. And I mean nobody. Surely he shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler and from the noisome pestilence. He shall cover thee with his feathers, O we man, and under his wings shall thou trust. And that's all I do. I sit up under them wings, honey. His truth shall be thy shield and buckler. Understand? Thou shalt not be afraid <laughs> for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that flies by day. I have no worries, people. When I lay down at night to go to sleep, I sleep. In the daytime, I don't worry about now motherfucker fucking with me. Nor for the pest silence that walketh in darkness. Nor for the destruction that wasted at noonday. None of it. A thousand, I just said this, a thousand shall fall at thy side. <laughs> And 10,000 at thy right hand, but it shall not come near thee. 
I'm watching y'all fall. I'm watching y'all family suffer because of y'all hand. Your own mama? Wow. I hope y'all feel good about yourself. Only with thy eyes shall thou behold and see the reward of the wicked. I see it every day. Because thou hast made the Lord, which is my refuge, even the most high, thy habitation. God is my baby. He my daddy. There shall be no evil befall thee. <laughs> Neither shall any plague come near thy dwelling. So anything y'all paying for or trying to send toward me, it ain't coming toward me. It's coming right back to you. Just just thought I'd... Because some of y'all preach this Bible, but some of y'all don't even live it. But some of y'all need to know this is what's happening to y'all evil motherfuckers in the church. Get ready. Amen, amen, amen. For he shall give his angels charge over thee. And let me stop there. I have two angels. Since the day I came out of my mama womb, two angels. Archangel Michael and Archangel Gabriel. So you know what that make me? I'm a bad motherfucking angel. You know why? I got the two head angel protecting me. Because you know why? I am somebody. I am who I say I am. I don't give a fuck who believe me, but you shall see the truth because I speak it and we're going to watch. Not only my eyes going to see, everybody around going to see. To keep thee in all thy ways, for he shall give his angels charge over thee to keep thee in all thy ways. <laughs> they shall bear thee up in their hands least thou dash thy foot against a stone. Thou shalt tread up on the lion and the adder, the young lion and the dragon shall trample under feet. Y'all can send anybody. I'm walking on them. President, sheriff, mayor, board of directors, trustee, hospital, teacher, Preacher, chefs, CPS, mamas and daddies and sisters and brothers and cousins. Because he has set his love up on me. Therefore, <laughs> will I deliver him. I will set him on high. Because he has known my name. That's why I'm exposing y'all and I'm calling y'all names. Because God said, go to, go ahead. Because it's the truth. And ain't nobody going to touch you. Because you got more protection than you even know you got. And you got people standing behind you that you don't even know standing behind you. From what I hear, it's people going to the police station telling the motherfucking police what they motherfucking white ass son did. Whoever it is. You're making your daddy look bad, boy. But your daddy going to have to pow, 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 trample down on you. That's what I just heard. He shall call up on me, and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble. I will deliver him and honor him. With long life will I satisfy her and shoot her. In my salvation. It say him, but I'm saying her. Because we talking about me. <laughs> <clears throat> yes, ma'am. And yes, sir. So. Y'all enjoy these messages that I put out for y'all. Because I don't speak nothing but the truth. And I tell y'all I fear nobody. I have nothing to fear. I ain't wrong nobody. I ain't done nothing to nobody. All I did was help people and been nice to people. And people took from me because 
they thought I was a dumb, weak nigga. And then once they found out that I read tarot, that was it. I'm I'm uh Miss Cleo. Uh uh-uh, uh, I ain't Miss Cleo. I'm better than Miss Cleo. Mm, I'm the real deal. I don't use nothing. I don't need nothing. I get the downloads from God. So no, I'm not Miss Cleo. And if Miss Cleo get downloads from God, well then hey, Miss Cleo it be. You feel me? <laughs> I ain't Miss Cleo and you ain't Miss Christian. You ain't Miss who you say you supposed to be. And I'ma say that you ain't supposed to be teaching noun word. That means Sunday school to no school. God say women don't teach. They sit and they listen. They don't run shit in the Lord's house. What you do, sit your ass down and get the word from a man. Okay? Yeah. Because you can't teach me shit that I don't already know. And if you ain't teaching it the right way, you really can't teach me a motherfucking thing when you ain't living the right way. That's right. So for all you motherfuckers that mad because I read tarot, that's, that's your business. I don't work for you. I work for God. And that's my calling. And I was called to do it. And had I not did it, baby, I'd have been dead or in prison. Huh? Or, or I'd have, y'all have got away with another murder. Huh? And, and not, not on me, you're not. Have a good morning. Ooh, we, I know I wake y'all up with these bangers in the morning. Collect it. Ooh, it's 111. 111.